There was a little dog named Zigadoo. He was kept in a small apartment where he spent most of his days. Every once in a while, he was let out to take a tinkle on a tree. Outside, he would look at that wide horizon and just imagine what else this world had to offer. Less than a minute later, he'd be taken back to his dwelling. When inside, he was quick to fall asleep. For that was when his spirit would wander. In his spirit place, he knew the joy of stretching his legs in full gallop, the wonderful sensation of stream water flowing past his little feet, and sunshine reflecting off his golden fur coat. He imagined how much healthier and happy his parents would be in this wonderful place. As always, he knew he would have to awaken and leave this paradise and go back to the misery of his little apartment. Or would he? When Zigadoo's owners awoke the next morning, they immediately felt a great absence. Upon investigation, they couldn't find any sign of their pet, Zigadoo, only a shadow of his former presence. This is where they knelt and wept, for the loss of the only source of light that they once had in their lives. It is said, that once in each decade, the Vortex Earth Spirits of Sedona, Arizona hold counsel to decide which mournful dreamer shall inherit their domain. This decade, Zigadoo was the subject of that counsel. Since that fateful night of Zigadoo's disappearance, there have been many reports of people glimpsing a little orange dog around the red cliffs of Sedona, Arizona. So if there, keep your eyes peeled, and you too may have the honor of witnessing his toothy smile. That is, the smile of Zigadoo.